Hi everybody, it's Kev here. Welcome to the Inspired Healing Podcast. This is a space where we talk about all things in the personal development field, from the Stoics and the Stoic philosophy to getting out of your comfort zone and living your life at an inspired, optimum level. We have guests who will inspire you with their stories of healing and courage and how they now inspire others. So please subscribe to my podcast and share any episodes that resonate with you with family and friends. And please support those who support us. Immune support is a supplement that really helps your immune system stay healthy during these chaotic times we live in. And Proven is quite possibly one of the world's very best natural weight loss supplements. The links to these beautiful life enhancing supplements are below in the show notes. For now, let's go inside. Morning, everybody. It's Kev here. Welcome to the Inspired Healing Podcast. Today is uh, Challenge Day. I want to give you a challenge today. Uh, but the challenge today is to go and read a book for 30 minutes every day for the next week till next Sunday when we do the next challenge. You know, you look at any successful entrepreneur, anybody who's successful in any field, and 99% of them, one thing they have in common is they read every day. They read a book. Bob Proctor, he's been teaching uh, personal development you know, for 58, 59 years, and he still reads every single day. And he says he's got so much more to learn. And he's, I think, 85, 86 years old. Uh, amazing guy. And you would think someone like him would, would know everything, wouldn't you? <laughs> but that uh, is certainly not the case. And it's not the case with anybody. Nobody knows everything. And uh, I think it's a great challenge to get out and read a book every day for 30 days. If you can do it longer than that, great. When I go for my runs, uh, I've got my little uh, earbuds in and I listen to uh, audio books. So you can read or listen to an audio book, but every day for 30 days, read something and read something that's going to help you, not um, not rubbish, okay? You know, don't go and read the, you know, Women's Weekly or The New Idea or something, you know, <laughs> something like that. Read books that have the potential to change your life. And like I say, 30 minutes every day, it's not hard, but I can hear a collective groan of people saying, oh, I just don't have time. I mean, if you're not where, you're, where you want to be in your life, then you should be reading for an hour, not half an hour. <laughs> So find some books. Uh, you can you know, find them online, lots of free books online. You can uh, download in a PDF form. Um, there are lots of audio books on YouTube you can listen to. Lots of great stuff on there. Um, I know Wallace Wattle's books. Um, I'm trying to think of the, uh, yeah, the Science of Getting Rich is a really good book, and that's on YouTube, and it's free. But you can also dan that, download that online for free. It's a free book. It's in the public domain. So lots of books out there like that. Uh, from a long time ago that are going to really help you. But it's really important to read something every day. Keep learning every day. That's one thing my dad, I remember, always instilled in me. He said, uh, Kev, you learn something every day. Never let a day go by where you don't learn something. And it's so true. And like I say, if it's good enough for Bob Proctor, uh, Bob Proctor still got his original version of Think and Grow Rich that uh, wonderful book by Napoleon Hill. And uh, he reads parts of that every day as well. He just continually reads that. And he has done so since 1962. He's been reading that book. and He's got the same copy. It's falling apart, but he will never get rid of it. And uh, like I say, if it's good enough for him to be learning something every day, then it's good enough for me. That's the challenge for today. And for the rest of this week, read for half an hour or listen to an audio book or listen to uh, something positive, some kind of personal development video on YouTube, a uh, half an hour every day. Set yourself the time and um, and stick to it. And like, don't just listen to this video and think, oh yeah, that, that sounds like a good idea, Kev. And then do nothing, which is what a lot of people do. They listen to things and uh, think, oh yeah, that's a great idea, yeah. And then five seconds later, once they've left that video or whatever, they just don't do anything. So do it. That's the challenge for the week. Find a good book, a book that's going to improve your mind, improve your life, and read it for half an hour every day for the next week. And if you can do it for the rest of your life, great. That's that should be your goal. And don't just give this video lip service and say, oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Actually go and do it. 
Uh, have a great uh, weekend and I'm back tomorrow. Take care and go and find a great book to read. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. I really hope you enjoyed today's podcast. If you did, please subscribe and leave a review. That really helps us and is very much appreciated. And also please share it with your family and friends. You can join us inside the 123 Meditation Club where we do five live meditations a week. The link to the club is down below. And we all need the immune support supplement during these crazy, chaotic times to stay healthy and keep COVID at bay. And Proven is quite possibly one of the world's very best natural weight loss supplements. All the links are down below. Thanks for listening.